Hey everybody, quick review on the Tide. This is the Tide coin. Honestly, I'm not 100% sure who makes this one. But this is the aluminum version. They also have it in acrylic. Uh, I bought it second hand for 20 bucks. I don't think that they go for much more uh, new. Um, and I thought, well, hell, it's worth a shot. And I gotta be honest, <clears throat> I don't hate this thing. Um, so it runs uh, a little similarly to the Spark, where it's got springs, uh, like recessed springs with little uh, balls on top. And so when you turn it, it pushes the balls down, and then eventually they catch in these little pockets, these little grooves in the top of the lid. And so it's not a noisy one. <clears throat> and there, there were actually, uh, there were uh, Teflon balls and then just regular steel bearings uh, that I was able to put in there. That's what I have in there right now. So you get a little more of a click. If you have the Teflon balls in there, it almost makes no sound. But I don't mind this thing. I, I think for the money, just to have the the haptic sensation, I guess, on your hand, and maybe you want a quieter fidget <clears throat> for work or something like that, um, this is kind of nice. That is the Tide coin, Tide haptic coin. And, uh, it's not so bad. Not a super glowing review, but maybe if you're on the lookout for this, it's got a fucking phenomenal noise. But if you're on the lookout for that and you can't find it, you could get the Tide coin and have something to, oh Jesus, tide you over. Sorry about that. Terrible joke. All right, anyway, Tide coin, Kyle signing.